always felt that about myself. That I am just unlucky. Or maybe being cursed. Come on in, Doc. Come on in. Do you have any idea what would happen to me if my wife is gonna find out? It's, I have kids. Just relax, bro. Just come with me. my parents in the fire and I've been abused and raped in the orphanage. That traumatized me for life. That was before Samantha. She was replacing me in the moments when I've been abused. It was too hard for me to cope. She was replacing my lack of strength with the power to survive in that filthy place. And then she met Dr. Roberts. He understood exactly what is happening with me. With us. You need help. I know good people. Just let me help. Why don't you let me help you? Red 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 Red. Red. He took advantage, thinking that he can do anything to us. Samantha fell in love. Little he knew that he was not the predator he wanted to be, and Nora was the prey. Roxanne was the last one that came along. She is the driven one, which fights with most of the demons. Or how she likes to call them hallucinations. She had one last demon to fight. Dr. Robert. She carries all the rage that got born since the moment he took advantage of us. I thought to myself that I finally yes. made it yes. and that I can finally let everything behind me but I was wrong the pain was traveling through all the personalities I was having nightmares where I was paralyzed and unable to protect myself from him I'm too scared to do anything right now running again. I run from myself, from the life I have, from us, from Dr. Robert. I run from everything. Is this the plan to bring Samantha up? Roxanne was having a secret plan. The customer you're trying to reach is not available. Please call 
so she played with my mind, giving me access to some of her demons. Fuck! 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 To scare me and to take me to leave my home. Why is she doing this? The worst part is that I have no control over it, do I? Hi babe, where are you? Sam, where are you? I can finally meet you. You put us in the cage. Me, Diane, and Samantha. Samantha. Remember Samantha? Remember me? I asked you first dog. I need to see you. I can't right now, I'm home. Just come tomorrow morning. No babe, morning. just be at mine tomorrow, okay? I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Oh, just stay there. All these nights, you put us in the cage and you wait us all You thought this is how it's gonna end up, isn't it? Yes, having multiple personalities is a hard condition to live with. But this doesn't mean I'm a monster. Or that when I wake up, I can't remember who I am. I do have gaps. But they slowly fade in. In the same way they fade out. Take a deep breath in. And relax. Roxanne, she has her own demons to fight with, but she's strong, it's not her first battle with them, with all the traumas. Mom used to sing this lullaby to me. And Samantha, she is the bravest one. She's not missing a single therapy session. Oh, hi there. Hi, this is Diane. I believe in her. Yes, may I please just book a therapy session with Dr. Roberts? I know that she has my strongest traits. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, yeah. Tuesday is fine. And she'll be here for okay, me. Okay, what time? Four o'clock. I'm not a monster. Lovely. Or a danger. Okay, thank you. I'll see you there. Cheers. I just want to Bye. live my life and to be accepted. Am I asking for too much? Who knows?